Coach, the game was pretty much decided in the last five, six minutes of the first half. What what did you see was the real turning point? I really felt that those last eight minutes of the first half was the best we played all year. We really, we were really good. And uh, I thought we were together. I thought uh, Isaiah Taylor tonight, maybe up until the end, did the best job he has all year in terms of really being a point guard that kept us going when uh, things might bog down a little bit. Uh, but it was a great team win, and we got really good production from our bench. But uh, turnovers, we've been, we ended up with 18 turnovers, but the first half we had five and got to the free throw line and you go back and look at our stats coming in. We had put in three games, we had allowed teams to shoot 100 free throws and turn it over more so than we assist. Even though we ended up with that tonight, we had more assists tonight than we normally have. But uh, at the end, I think it's very hard for a young team to know how to play with a lead in terms of uh, when you're in a clock situation too, when to score, when not to. And, but everything that we talked about not doing, we did there at the end. But it was a really a great win for us. It really was. You talked about offensively, defensively. You didn't give them anything at the rim. They didn't hit shots. How good was your defense? Well, we, we're, we got shot blockers. But we did a better job for the most part tonight staying in front of the ball. We've been getting driven by and and um, the start of the game I thought we really got in a stance and did some good things the second half not so much but the fact is we we've got guys that can block shots and up to this point tonight they've been in foul trouble because our perimeter guys have just been driven driven by and uh, putting all the pressure on the uh, post guys at the rim but uh, Cam again you look at we had two guys with 12 rebounds and we think we can rebound, and uh, Isaiah, when he plays his best, he, I mean, he had eight rebounds tonight, and he's he's really good at it, you know. And Demarcus Holland settled back down. He's been putting a lot of pressure on himself, but he settled down tonight and and uh, did a really good job. Made a couple key plays, and I thought a big key part of the game in the second half was when uh, uh, Felix had the fouls, and and uh, Isaiah went down, and Demarcus Holland went to the point, and. The experience he got there a year ago helped because he made a couple of really good plays against their, their, their pressure. This series has been pretty close score-wise. Did you anticipate a no. double-digit win tonight? No, I mean, no, absolutely not. And You know, I, I think, you know, it's a quick turnaround for both teams, but, I mean, it's, it's a tough, tough one when you have a chance to beat a team that's ranked as high as Oklahoma State was and, and you know, let it get away there from you at the end, or then make a shot that's, you know, it's tough, and then come back. And uh, But, you know, I've got so much respect for for, uh, for Bobby, and uh, I think he's kind of – we're both kind of doing the same thing. We're trying to get the program our programs back with the kind of guys, we, and I, I think he feels good about his guys. Like, uh, And we're both to totally different teams. But we actually talked about a year ago, we played twice, and games are very close. But, uh, no, I don't – think I would ever go to any game expecting this, like this. Coach, you seemed like a time your best offense was a missed shot tonight. Is that kind of common, just dominating them underneath? Well, there's times. You know, there is times. It's, it, might, it might be the best shot for some of our post players because they draw such a crowd. And the one thing I hope Cam Ridley, again, learned tonight is he's got to keep it off the floor. Every, in the first play of the game, he can't do what he did. I mean, everybody knows you can't just run over a guy. but. He, he was really – Cam was good tonight, and uh, he just, again, he's got to keep it up. And uh, But our guys, uh, they, they like each other. I mean, and that goes a long way. And they uh, – we had we'd really hit a we, – we told him uh, before Christmas, we thought we had a, a special group of guys, but once we came back from Christmas, we haven't been very good, even from the time we played our, our last non-league game. And, and the thing that we've t told them, we didn't have to talk about the, the kind of effort that it takes to win. We didn't, or we we know we haven't played with that same kind of passion. But tonight, I thought our guys came ready to play, and and uh, really it was as good an effort as we've had overall 